Hello, welcome. My name is Michelle with Phoenix Flow Art. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. So today I'm going to do uh, Dutch Pour Bloom. This is the first time I've even attempted this. Um, it's a cross between Shell Yard Bloom and your traditional Dutch Pour. So here I am laying out my background, which is a titanium white spreading it out and it's the consistency of a Dutch pour paint. So I'm working on an eight by eight gallon wrap canvas and you try to lay your flood coat as evenly as you can. However, you are creating a thin pillow in the center. So you have a lot more paint in the center. I'm going to create a puddle and the first color of my puddle is going to be a yellow. Gonna follow that up with an orange yellow. I mixed an orange and yellow together. Or yellow orange. And then my final color is going to be just an orange. And my metallic color I'm going to use is a gold and that's gonna be my centerpiece. And the idea is to create this flower. And you can have a four petal flower or a five petal flower. So I just mixed my paint, so I'm blow, um, busting the bubbles and I'm going to blow it out now. And these are my petals. Some things I learned by doing this. One, I'm blowing it out too far. Um, I think you have to be real careful not to blow it out as far as I did. And you also need to try to keep the centerpiece a circle. And you also need to try to get the petals to be about the same size. So I'm going to drag my finger towards the center to make the petals a little bit more individual. Even though mine are already that way because I blew it too far. But again, this is my first time. Um, so I was learning. I do like the process. So I'm definitely going to do it again. And I ended up liking the, the end result. After I get the composition and the petals to look the way I want, then I spin it out just like you would do a bloom. Now my canvas was eight by eight, so it was small. So I probably should have used a little less paint. So therefore my petals would not have blown up so much. Um, however, like I said, I did like the end result. So next I'm going to take my palette knife and I'm going to try to shape the petals in a way that I like. I'll let you watch the rest of the video. Again, my name is Michelle with Phoenix Flow Art. I will be attempting this again in the very near future. Creating is what we do.